As soon as you connect the device to the system, a scanner status pop-up window automatically opens up. You can see that the device is ready to scan. For any reason, if this window does not open on its own, you can activate it manually. In order to do so, open the application by clicking on the icon. Under the Tools tab, click on Start I Capture Train to Disk. A pop window opens up and shows the status of the device. It turns green when the device is ready to scan. When you minimize this window, it will go and sit in the bottom right corner. Click here to add a patient. Enter all the required details in this form. You can also add an image of a patient. Click OK to add a patient. In Preview tab, you can see the images that are already scanned and saved. Under List tab, you can see the list of the scanned images, reconnect the server if it is in idle mode. As soon as you scan, the image is transferred to the application. Now you can assign this image to a current patient or to another patient by selecting the already registered patient. In order to add this to a new patient click here, in this case, I will add the image to the current patient. You will find all the tools to edit the image. You can flip the image horizontally, rotate by 90 degrees, restore to original image if you don't want the changes made, sharpen the image, click here to brighten by one step or darker. Hide or show the scale by clicking here, show or hide image editing tools by clicking on this icon, click here to show or hide a dentist chart. In order to assign a tooth to the image, right click over the image, go to edit image notes, select a tooth from this chart. You can add notes if any. Now you can see the selected tooth in the chart. Click here to close all images. Double click on the same icon to show them, select a ready-made template for your images. You will find lot of options to select. You can add more images to study using this link. Select the images you want to add and click open. The selected images are added to the list, take a screenshot and save it in the desired folder. Use save image as to save in any format of your choice. Click here to save the changes you have made, edit the image using these tools, zoom in and zoom out. Use scale tool to measure the distance between points. Change the font color, size, and the font. Change the color of the line. You can change the shape of the line as well. If you want to delete a font or a line, simply select and delete. Draw a circle to point a portion of the image. Change the color if you wish. Use a marker tool to mark anywhere in the image. Edit the color and thickness of the marker. Delete all the selected changes, draw a line using this tool. Add a text and place it anywhere in the image. You can select a font, size and color of the font. Measure the angle using this tool. Place the anchor point anywhere in the image and adjust both the lines for a desired angle. Font size, color and the font can be changed. When you click on implant tool, a pop-up window opens up. You can select the implant make and model from this list. You can edit the implant using edit option. Hide or show implant. Add description. When you double click on an image, I pop up window opens up. You will find more image editing tools here. Use this tool to change the sharpness. Click apply after making the change. You will see that the sharpness is increased. Click here to remove all filters. Selected filter. Factory filter settings. Here you can choose from ready-made filters for the image. 
change the gamma levels. There are three image edit memory settings. Make the changes and save those settings for each memory. Whenever you want to apply these filters, press on the filter memory. When you right click on the image, you will find the image editing tools here as well. Save the image after editing. Now to generate a report, click on report tab. Here select the orientation of the report. Portrait or landscape. You can also select single page or multiple pages. I have selected a portrait mode. To copy the image to the report, click on the image and again on the report window. Save the report. You can open the saved report by clicking on open. Print a report using a printer connected to the system. To buy genuine spares and dental equipments, visit our online store www.confidentonline.com. If you need more information, please reach out to our support team.